Hello everyone, in this video I will be solving Cambridge AS level information technology paper 2 for May June 2024. I am going to do the sound editing task. The previous task database is already done and uploaded. You can find the link in the description. So the sound editing starts from step 5. Open the file audio.mp3 in a suitable audio editing package. So I am using Audacity here. Now these are the files. So first we need to open audio.mp3. So this is the file. You can drag it to Audacity. Remove the silence at the start of the clip. So here you can see the first 5 seconds we have silence. So we need to remove that. So select it and then you can cut it. Change the speed of the clip so that it is half the original speed. So select the clip. Now go to effect, change speed. So you need to change it to half. So 0 0.5. Give OK. So the speed is changed. Mix down the drag so that the finished sound drag is monophonic. So keep the track selected. Now go to tracks, stereo track to mono. So now it is monophonic. Export the file in .mp3 format as left followed by your center number, candidate number. Make sure that you change the track title to left during the export. So here we have the track title. Click on this. We can change it to left. Give OK. Now let's export it. File export audio. Export it to your folder. And the name should be left followed by your center number and candidate number. Make sure it is mp3 file. And I have used 128 kbps because it's a standard format. Save. Reduce the volume of the track so it is a quarter of the original volume. So in order to reduce the volume, you can go to effect and then amplify. The amplification units is given in decibels. You can see it is 3.291. So if you want to reduce it to half the volume, almost 6 to 10 d has to be reduced. You can see minus 6 b dB to minus 10 dB will be about half volume. So as an approximate I will give minus I'll reduce minus 12 to be quarter. So from this value I'll reduce minus 12 so that we get minus 8.709. So I'll just give Anyway, any negative value will reduce the volume. So minus 8.709, give OK. So it is, the volume is reduced now. Export the file in .ogg format as right followed by your center number and candidate number. So for here also the track title, you can just, it's not asked, but just we can change it. Now let's export it. Export as. Right followed by your center number and candidate number and it should be OGG file. So here we have OGG and then save. Open the file voice.mp3 in a suitable package. So let's close this. Now you have to import voice. So this is the voice file. 
add reverb to the clip so that it sounds like the voice is echoing in a room. So select the track. Now go to effect. You can go to reverb. Click on manage and factory presets. It's not mentioned which kind of room. So let's select medium room. Give OK. Lengthen this track so that the voice starts after 10 seconds. So keep your cursor at the beginning. Now we have to add 10 seconds, um, 10 seconds or lengthen this track so that the voice will start after 10 seconds. So let's keep the selection tool here and go to generate silence and generate the silence for 10 seconds here. You can type 10 seconds here. Give OK. So now you can see the sound starts from 10 seconds. Export the file in .mp3 format as voice followed by your sender number and candidate number. So file, export audio. Voice followed by your sender number and candidate number as mp3 format. So mp3, save. Open the left saved in step 5. So let's close this. Open the left. So we have the left here. Fade out the track between 5 and 10 seconds. So select from 5 to 10 seconds. You can make sure it is 5 and 10. So we have selected 5 to 10 seconds and we need to fade out this. So go to effect, fade out. Mute the sound between 10 to 18 seconds. So 10 to 18. You have to select 10 to 18. Make sure it is 10. You can type it here. 10 to Eighteen seconds. So it is selected. Ten to eighteen seconds should be muted. So select this. Now go to edit to remove special, and then silence audio. So that is muted. Fade in the track between eighteen to twenty-three seconds. Eighteen to twenty three. It should be faded in. So go to effect, fade in. Add the voice track saved in step six and mix down these tracks into a single mono track. So in step 6, we had saved the voice track. So let's bring the voice track here. So after adding, we have to uh, mix into a single mono track. So go to tracks. 
you can see mix and render to new track so this is the mix track you can just close these two so this is the new one set this as the left track and use the file right saved in step 5 as the right track of your stereo input so let's add the right track now So this is the right track. Set a two second fade out on both tracks starting at 25 seconds. A two second fade out should be given starting at 25 seconds. So select this track 25 to 27. And it should be fade fade out so let's give go to effect fade out and same way for this track also twenty five to twenty seven effect fade out trim the clip to twenty seven seconds so select the clip from 27 till the end and now we need to remove this. So make this exactly at 27. And we need to remove this. So click on cut. It's gone. Export the file in .mp3 format. So before that, we have to do this. Mix down these tracks into a single mono track. So the mix track should be set as the left track and the uh, file right should be set as the right track. So the mix trap should be left. So click here and you have to set it to left channel and this one should be set to right channel. So these steps we have done. Export the file in .mp3 format as jewel followed by your center number, candidate number. So file, export audio. The name should be and mp3 file save give ok so this is the end of the audio editing task you can find the link for the database task in the description thank you for now